Hello everybody, it's me Janet again. The summer holidays are over, we are back again and I'm very glad about it. Today I will show you the treatment of periodontitis. Therefore we will use the diode laser and a special kind of dye. The periodontitis is a bacterial disease and I want to show you some pictures before we start with the treatment. And as you can see, the inflammation of the gum, you can see the swollen gingiva, you can see the high bleeding index, and the patient doesn't feel very comfortable as well. Just before we start with the treatment, uh, remember that we have to remove bacterials. And on one hand, you can use antibiotics. On the other, you could use the diode laser. I choose the diode compared with a special dye. Just let us start. For treating the periodontitis by using the diode laser, you have the choice between using a blue color or using a green color. Today I decided the green dye and therefore we do need three different light fibers. And first of all, we do have to take off the salvatory. Now we take our color and we put the color among the gingiva like this. Now we take the fiber and we move the fiber above the gingiva like this for 10 seconds. We do not have any contact to the surface of the gingiva. Now we do have to take off the old dye. Bitte mal absaugen. No. Also we take off the salvatory. Now before I put on fresh dye, we have to change our fiber. This is the transgingival fiber. I think you already have seen it on one of the videos before. Now we take the bulb fiber. Of course, we put on fresh color at the gingiva. Now we take our fiber and we move the fiber under the gingiva like this. Also for 10 seconds. We take off the old dye, take off the uh, salvatory and we repeat our workflow with the third fiber. The third fiber is called bar fiber. And yes, you are right, of course, first of all, we take off the salvatory, then we put on fresh color and we activize our color with our laser light. Taking off the salvatory, put on fresh color. Take our third fiber light. Go under the gingiva, move the fiber slowly under the gingiva and of course also for 10 seconds. Just in case you decide to take the blue dye, the blue color, uh, you only need one fiber. When uh, you take the green one, you need it uh, you need three light fibers and you have to repeat the workflow for three times. 
So now we take off, at least we take off the salvatory and of course we take off the old uh, dye and the treatment is done. And as you can see, the patient, the patient is very relaxed, didn't feel any pain and we are able to treat these kind of uh, disease without any antibiotics. Now I'm very interested of the opinion of the patient, what she says to our treatment. So it was very comfortable and absolutely painless. So just to sum up for you, now you know that the uh, periodontitis is a bacterial disease. Cleaning is not enough. You do need antibiotics or you do have to use the diode laser compared with the dye. Just in case you use the blue dye, you need one fiber. When you prefer the green dye, you do have to need three light fibers. And anyway, what kind of dye you use, you must say the diode laser treatment was absolutely smooth, the patient had no pain and the advantages of the diode treatment is you don't need any antibiotics, so you don't have any intolerances and the cure is very quickly and it's nice, a nice treatment, painless. So I hope I could inspire you today as well. See you next time. I count on you. We are back from our summer holidays. Yeah, wollte ich nicht sagen, Isan. Der rote Punkt, ne? Today I will show you the periodontitis. Ich, ja. Why not? Nee. For me it was very comfortable and it was absolutely painless. So. so. <laughs> so wollte ich sagen. Ich wollte.